Hey, mononuclear or uh, single sentences in the Russian. In this video we will learn what is it, what uh, we can use, how we can use and all about it in this video. Yes, uh, привет, друг, hello, friend, it was on the Russian language and uh, right now we want to talk about this. And we will open our whiteboard, not this, we will use our this big. And uh, also we can do some marks here. And what is it? It's easy, easy full uh, sentences in the Russia. It's like, a, I like my mom. And uh, do you like my mom? Or uh, do you like your mom? And something like this. I go to the store. I go to the shop. I, I go to shopping. Yes. It's easy words, what we can use, sentences. I'm native Russian and I, I can speak Russian 21 years uh, at result. Okay, and let's start. Our easy, easy lesson number two. And thank you for Lucy who asked that question. Maybe she asked me about questions. Uh, sentences, yes, how to create sentences in the English, but we're gonna talk about uh, ah, easy lesson number two. Yes, we're gonna to, <laughs> we're gonna speak about sentences, easy sentences for uh, everybody speaking. Everybody, I wanna say, everybody in the Russia will will understand you if you will use easy sentences. I promise you. I promise you, everybody who who older than maybe 10 year old, 10 year olds, 10 years old will understand you. Is 100% you, I give you. Okay, what is it? Is it lessons? Is a lesson? What is it? Is it sentences? Yes, is it mean? What is? One moment, I want to show you. It means that we have one known yes known like a i yes i will be on the russian yeah i or yeah yes elsa we have verb verb will be love love is i love you yes Love is любить. Люблю. 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 Infinitive of the люблю is uh, любить. But люблю in this situation we use. Я люблю. What, I, what do I love? What do I люблю? I love... Okay, plus. Need other color. Plus, plus, and black. And what do I люблю? What, what do я люблю? I love my mother. What this will be? Is adjective, yes? Adjective for... Uh, one moment, need to Google. Is addition. Addition will be addition or... Okay, addition will be... Plus one add. Using. Okay, add verb known. Is our sentences um, mom? Mamu. Infinitive form of mamu is mama. Я люблю маму. I love mom. If you want to do something plus, pos plus possessive, possessive pronoun is will be my mom, my you mamu. Okay? But we use our easy sentence. Я люблю что? Маму. I love what? Mom. Understand? Good. It's our sentences when we want to say something easy. Easy jokes, easy sentence, when you want to say something. Use first known verb addiction. Everybody will know, will understand you. 100% I give you. 
Я люблю маму, я люблю папу, я люблю сестру, сестра и сестер, папа и папа. Я люблю мир, мир из world. Understand? Super is our opportunity to see everything you ever wanted in one moment, okay? Okay, let's erase it fully. Next. It, it was for our when we want to say fact, fact about something, yes? Fact, like a present simple, yes, in the your language. Super is known plus form, we will say it. Known plus plus who plus verb plus add addiction. Okay. Super is plus form. Elsa, if we wanna do some of the answers, what we will use? Answer, yes? How? How? Everybody will ask us. Rules are simple. Noun plus verb. And don't forget about point here. Plus add. That's all. And our question mark on the end. Question point. How to do this? For example. Okay, add the color. T. T is you. T. Любишь. Любишь is uh, любить, love. Маму. Ма. Му. Свою маму. Свою means your, your own. Ты любишь маму. You love mom. Your mom. How it will be on the question? Ты любишь. I will write examples on the our description. Mamu. It's same, yes? But here we have dot and here will be question mark. And everybody in the Russia will understand you. Only what need to do. When you say phrase like a your question, no, like a your Fact, yes, fact that ты любишь маму. Ты любишь маму. Ты любишь маму. It's simple, like a, okay, five varieties. If we use uh, happy, ты любишь маму. Next, fear, ты любишь маму. Next uh, is expression of the, uh, oh my gosh, what is, ты любишь маму. Uh, fourth is will be, ты, it will be, Ты любишь маму. Yes, it's like a spy. And angry. Ты любишь маму. <laughs> it was, oh my gosh, who used it? Uh, okay, and how to create a question? Need only use your expression skill. Ты любишь маму. Ты любишь маму. Ты любишь маму. Please, as, please, uh, give me answer. Пожалуйста, ответь. Ты любишь маму. Okay, understand? What it means. But in the English it will be. I love mom, yes, and do you love mom? In the Russian, it's more simplest that you can only imagine, yes? In the English, I love mom. And for asking question, need some of the questionable words uh, plus. Do you love mom? No. In the Russian only question mark and that's all. Super, go away. Understand? I think you understand. It was some of the for the simplest. How to? The simple. The, the simplest way 
Easy sentence. Size. Okay, more, bigger. Okay, and uh, here. And uh, plus color. Let's give me a color of the maybe red. Ah, okay, blue will be. I'm blue, the body, the body. Okay, the simplest way, easy sentence. Understand? Understand? If not, please write in the comment section. I hope that yes, I'm native and I understand it uh, correctly. Maybe you not fully understand. It's really simple rule. And everybody in the Russia, if you don't want to be native, if you don't want to be, everybody will understand you. But if you more, if you want more, be like a native, really native, and everybody will ask me, Oi, you are from, do you from Russia, really? Oh, do you from America, really? Hmm, I thought that you are from Russia. Uh... I know one girl who from how it is Swiss, yes, yeah, Switzerland. Switzerland. I know one girl. Switzerland is uh, when we have uh, white, uh, white, uh, like a Jesus Christ thing, and uh, on the red color. Yes, Swiss. One moment. Need to Google. Maybe you don't understand what I what I mean. Swiss country. Country. Yes, that country. Yes, understand? One girl from the Switzerland now speaking really native. I firstly I thought that she is uh, really native. And you can be too. Only practice and I will help you if you want to be native. Ask question for being native more. And it was really a second lesson for you. I hope that you enjoyed be strong, be funny. And uh, understand it fully. You will understand it. I hope. And uh, everybody will understand it. And everybody will understand you. Need only practice. And please. If somebody will, will, will say for you. No need to learn Russian. Do some action like that. And now listen to that person. You can. And nobody can't nobody can to say for you that you can't you can you can learn russian and you can learn it with easy ways with easy and fastest ways yes will be good job and really intention need to be and really hard working but it's your life okay hard work first second and last component of the our formula of success in the Russian okay thank you so much for watching I hope that you enjoyed with it and in the next in the next video we will talk about greetings it was simple way yes and from from first video to next we will know more more intellectual quality yes okay I hope you understand me I am not Russian Sorry for my English if I maybe said something not wrong in the English. But uh, Russian I really understandable and uh, my exams for you special of the Russian it it was in the the best points in the in the school in the exams for the university and I hope it shows you something and also I can speak on the Russian uh, good with good quality like. Uh, <laughs> Привет, друг. <laughs> okay. Okay, I hope you understand me and uh, see you in the next time and uh, don't forget who you are and be strong. Learn it. T next video about greetings. Yeah, like a Привет, друг. Do Добрый день, дорогие дамы и господа. Я вас приветствую здесь. Yes, I <laughs> I really greet you. Okay, thank you. See you next time. Bye-bye.